Hello, I'm Dr. Mark Newman, and I'd like to welcome you back. Remember, we believe that when you change your health, you'll change your life, and our goal for you is to add years to your life and life to your years. Let's talk about radioactive iodine treatment. We've been talking about hyperthyroidism, and the question we're going to answer for you is, is radioactive treatment for hyperthyroidism the right treatment for you? I want to remind you to hit the like and share button and send this video to family and friends that would find this information helpful. First of all, we've told you now, the thyroid gland is the master gland of all metabolic processes of the body. It's a small gland that sets in front of the neck. And hyperthyroidism is when you have an overproduction of those hormones. Now, when that happens, you've got a metabolic and a toxic problem going on in the body it has to be treated. There's imbalance that must be addressed. And this is one of the options for treating that. Okay, treatment with radioactive iodine. First of all, it's relatively safe, very easy to do. You take a dose of radioactive iodine, it's usually orally. What happens then is that iodine attaches or is drawn to the cells of the thyroid gland because iodine is concentrated in the thyroid gland. Now this radioactive iodine then will actually destroy the cells of the thyroid. For most people, one treatment is all they need. This is the most common treatment for hyperthyroidism. It's generally used for people over 50. It can take a period of months before you have the full effects. During this time, your doctor will obviously be monitoring you to see how it's working, how it's affecting you, and how the thyroid gland is or isn't functioning as time goes on. Now, let's talk about the side effects with this. Well, first and foremost, the most common side effect is the thyroid doesn't work anymore. It does not produce the hormones, so you have the condition of hypothyroidism, which, by the way, is easy to treat. Most patients after this treatment are going to require lifelong treatment with thyroid supplementation, thyroid medication. Easy to do, easy to monitor. Now some people with the iodine might notice a metallic taste for a period of time after treatment. This is usually transient and will go away. Also, nausea can be another side effect that you might notice with the treatment. Again, transient and that will go away. And then lastly, there might be some swelling of the salivary glands around the thyroid region. So, there you go. That's our discussion about radioactive treatment for hyperthyroidism. In our next lecture, we'll talk about some natural methods that can help address hyperthyroidism. We look forward to seeing you then and appreciate you joining us. Thanks again for watching tonight. I'd like to invite you to take a look at our blog post where we discuss these topics in more detail. Subscribe to our YouTube channel. Give us a like on Facebook. Leave us a comment with questions or topics you'd like us to cover. This is Dr. Mark Newman. I appreciate you joining us.